Do you remember Darcy Lynn's stunning victory on America's Got Talent? From the moment she stepped on the stage, she mesmerized millions with her ventriloquism and stunning voice. Yet, beyond her charming performances, there is a side of Darcy Lynn that America's Got Talent didn't reveal to us. And in this video, we'll catch up with her and explore her true life behind the modest onstage smiles and lovable puppets. This is a tale of challenges, determination, tough decisions, sacrifices, and life and death. At just 13 years old, there was no fun for Darcy Lynn. She is a talented performer, but that is a result of countless hours dedicated to perfecting her craft. She often practiced late into the night while her peers were out having fun. Despite struggling with shyness and stage fright, she forged ahead. With the support of her family, she learned to channel her anxiety into her performances, transforming her vulnerabilities into strengths. So how did she get to one of the biggest stages to showcase her talent? It all began when this Oklahoma City native, just 12 years old, stepped onto the stage of one of the biggest talent competitions in the world, America's Got Talent. With her innocent smile and sparkling eyes, she held her puppet Petunia Rabbit close and faced the judges with a mix of nerves and excitement. As the music began, Darcy's voice filled the auditorium and the audience and judges watched in awe as this young girl and her puppet performed a stunning duet. When the song ended, the room erupted in applause, and Judge Mel B, clearly moved, hit the golden buzzer. Darcy showered with golden confetti wad catapulted straight to the live shows and into the hearts of millions. Each week, Darcy returned to the stage with a new puppet and a fresh performance, blending ventriloquism with song and humor. Whether it was Oscar the Mouse or Edna the Old Lady, her characters each had a unique personality that Darcy brought to life with incredible skill. Her performances were more than just entertaining. They were enchanting, showcasing a talent far beyond her years. The grand finale was the culmination of her journey, a night filled with tension and excitement. Darcy, flanked by her trusty puppets, delivered a performance that was nothing short of spectacular. As the judges deliberated and the audience waited with excitement, Darcy stood with grace and poise, a young girl who had already won the hearts of millions. When the moment of truth arrived, Darcy's name was called as the winner of the 12th season of America's Got Talent. The crowd erupted in cheers, and Darcy, overwhelmed with emotion, hugged her puppets tight. She had made history as the youngest contestant to win the show, and also the recipient of the most number of votes in the whole history of the program, taking home the $1 million prize and a newfound level of fame. Darcy was able to achieve her victory due to her hard work and skill. However, she was always eager to learn. She received guidance from a trusted figure who helped shape her. She isn't the first child star that had a master show her the ropes of her craft. Justin Timberlake was mentored by Mickey Mouse Club's talented coaches and Shirley Temple, guided by iconic Hollywood directors. Darcy simply followed in their footsteps as Gary Owen became her mentor and played a crucial role in shaping her into the captivating performer she is today. He guided her through the intricacies of puppet manipulation and voice control, ensuring that her performances were technically flawless. However, Gary's influence went beyond the mechanics of ventriloquism. He helped Darcy understand the importance of engaging with her audience, teaching her how to read their reactions and adapt her act to keep them entertained. He showed her how to infuse her performances with emotion, humor, and authenticity, ensuring that each act was not just a display of skill, but a compelling story. His mentorship was instrumental in helping Darcy develop the confidence and charisma that made her a standout performer on America's Got Talent. Gary's guidance didn't stop when Darcy won the competition. He continued to support Darcy as she embarked on her national tours, serving as both her coach and producer. So how did he become her mentor? In 2014, at the age of 10, Darcy entered the 2014 International Cinderella Scholarship Program after much encouragement from her parents. She performed excellently, and her parents and the audience were amazed. She won the competition and met a high-ranking ventriloquist, the international teen title holder Larissa Bonaquisti, who gave her some tips. Darcy took those lessons to heart, and would spend countless evenings perfecting her technique, hours of practice and self-teaching. Her first puppet, Petunia Rabbit, quickly became her loyal sidekick. 
Together, they performed at local events and talent shows, captivating audiences with their charming routines. What truly caught Darcy's attention was the way ventriloquism allowed her to connect with people, making them laugh and forget their worries, even if just for a moment. Ventriloquism also helped Darcy overcome her shyness. With Petunia by her side, she felt a newfound confidence and freedom. The puppet became her voice, allowing her to express herself in ways she never thought possible. After a month of practicing and following the advice Bonacquisti gave her, Darcy entered Edmund's Got Talent and won first prize. It was there that Gary Owen saw her. He saw something special in Darcy, recognizing not only her technical potential, but also her genuine love for the art. He immediately offered to become her mentor, and she accepted. With his years of experience and expertise, Gary became both mentor and guide, shaping Darcy's skills with patience and precision. He taught her the intricate mechanics of ventriloquism, perfecting lip control, creating distinct voices for her puppets, and mastering the art of seamless dialogue. Gary's coaching was rigorous yet encouraging, pushing Darcy to refine every aspect of her act, but it paid off as she won America's Got Talent. In the years following her victory on America's Got Talent, Darcy quickly transitioned from the TV stage to live performances, embarking on a nationwide tour called Darcy Lynn and Friends Live. The tour was a massive success, drawing in fans from all over who were eager to see her perform live. Her shows were a delightful mix of ventriloquism, comedy, and music. Her fame continued to grow as she appeared on various talk shows and special events. She performed on stages across the country, including prestigious venues like the Grand Ole Opry. Her charming personality and incredible skill made her an in-demand TV guest, where she was often invited to share her journey and showcase her talent. She got interviewed by Vogue, where she got to answer personal questions like her favorite things, artists, and who her celebrity crush was. She appeared on The Ellen Show, where she spoke about how she'd discovered her craft, her experiences, dreams, and the hard work behind her success. Ellen and Darcy explored the young star's journey from her humble beginnings in Oklahoma. Her candidness and humility shone through, giving viewers a glimpse into the person behind the puppets. She also started appearing in holiday specials, where she brought festive cheer to households across the nation. One notable appearance was in the Darcy Lynn, My Hometown Christmas special. In this heartwarming show, she invited viewers into her world, sharing her holiday traditions and performing alongside her puppets. The special featured guest appearances from renowned artists and friends, adding an extra layer of joy and celebration. Beyond holiday specials, Darcy's commitment to giving back saw her participating in numerous charity events. She lent her talent to causes close to her heart, performing at fundraisers and special events aimed at making a difference. Her performances not only entertained but also inspired generosity, reflecting her desire to use her platform for good. These appearances showcased Darcy's compassion and her belief in the power of community, further endearing her to fans. Beyond her live performances, Darcy has been actively engaging with her fans through social media. She regularly shares behind-the-scenes moments, live music sessions, offering covers of popular songs, and occasionally debuting her own compositions. These actions have allowed her to connect with her audience on a personal level, giving fans a glimpse into her creative process and daily life. However, this isn't easy. Balancing the pressures of school and a growing career is a challenge, especially for a young star like Darcy Lynn. However, it is not as intense as the battle Darcy would face. What battle is this? Keep watching to find out. Darcy began homeschooling in eighth grade, but before then, she was a regular student at Deer Creek Middle School in Oklahoma. Before she began to homeschool, Darcy faced the typical ups and downs of student, with the added layer of public scrutiny. She had to learn to balance her private life with her public persona, ensuring that she stayed true to herself while managing her growing fame. Amidst the glittering lights and applause, school remained a priority for Darcy and she was determined to keep up with her studies despite her demanding schedule. Juggling homework, exams, and projects alongside rehearsals and performances required immense discipline and time management skills. She often found herself studying late into the night 
or catching up on schoolwork between shows. Unfortunately, it got too much. Darcy began experiencing health issues that led to a diagnosis of cancer. The diagnosis was a shock not only to her but to everyone who knew and loved her. The vibrant, energetic girl who had captivated millions was now facing one of the toughest battles of her life. The fight against cancer was grueling. Darcy underwent multiple treatments including surgery and chemotherapy. The process was physically exhausting and emotionally draining, testing her strength and resolve. Throughout this challenging period, Darcy's family was her rock. They rallied around her, providing unwavering support and encouragement. Her parents, Clark and Misty Farmer, and her three brothers, Nate, Dalton, and Nick, were by her side every step of the way. Even in the face of such adversity, Darcy's passion for performance never wavered. She continued to practice her ventriloquism and singing whenever her health allowed. The act of performing and her family were sources of strength and solace for her. Fortunately, in July 2020, after months of treatment and a relentless fight, Darcy received the news she had been hoping for. She was certified cancer-free. The moment was one of immense relief and joy, not only for Darcy but for her family, friends and fans who had followed her journey closely. It marked the end of a harrowing chapter and the beginning of a renewed life filled with hope and possibilities. After her getting cured from cancer, Darcy has been busy with a variety of projects and performances. In April 2022, Darcy took a bold step into the world of acting with her debut in the short film A Cowgirl Song. This venture marked a new chapter in her career, showcasing her versatility and willingness to explore different aspects of the entertainment industry. Her performance received praise, further solidifying her reputation as a multi-talented artist. Still in 2022, Darcy embarked on her third tour, My Lips Are Sealed, Except When They Aren't, which ran from July to November. This tour was a spectacular showcase of her diverse talents, combining her signature ventriloquism with stunning vocal performances and her unique brand of comedy. Each show was a vibrant display of creativity, leaving audiences across the country in awe. Darcy also returned to the America's Got Talent stage, not as a contestant, but as a celebrated alum. She participated in the spin-off AGT Fantasy League, where she initially performed with her beloved puppet Petunia. However, in a surprising and courageous move, Darcy later took the stage solo, armed with a guitar and her voice. This performance was a declaration of her growth and her desire to break free from the 12-year-old ventriloquist image. It was a powerful statement, demonstrating her evolution as an artist and her readiness to embrace new challenges. Throughout her journey, Darcy has shown an incredible ability to adapt and expand her horizons. Whether it's through live tours, social media engagements, acting roles, or returning to familiar stages, she continues to captivate and inspire. Her story is one of resilience, creativity, and the unyielding pursuit of excellence. As Darcy continues to grow and explore her talents, one thing is certain, her star will only shine brighter with each passing year. She has even began to use her light to brighten up other people's life. After her battle with cancer, which emerged from with a renewed sense of purpose, she was determined to use her platform to make a difference in the fight against the deadly disease. Darcy became a vocal advocate for cancer awareness, sharing her journey openly and candidly with her fans. She participated in campaigns and charity events aimed at raising awareness about the importance of early detection and supporting cancer research. Her story resonated with many, providing hope and encouragement to those facing similar battles. One of Darcy's most impactful initiatives was her involvement in fundraising events for cancer research. She used her talent and influence to draw attention to these causes, performing at benefit concerts and participating in awareness campaigns. Her efforts helped raise significant funds for cancer research, contributing to the fight for a cure. The Toby Keith Foundation in Oklahoma, which is an organization committed to assisting children who are afflicted with cancer, was one of the key supporters of Darcy's advocacy work. The foundation, established by the late country music icon Toby Keith, is dedicated to supporting pediatric cancer patients and their families through its initiative, OK Kids Corral. This cost-free home provides a safe haven for children receiving treatment. 
offering a comforting environment for families during one of the most challenging times of their lives. The Toby Keith and Friends Golf Classic, held annually in Norman, Oklahoma, has become a beacon of hope and generosity over the past two decades. The event, which combines a gala dinner, silent auction, and a golf tournament, has raised millions of dollars to support the OK Kids Corral, a sanctuary for families of children undergoing cancer treatment. At a recent event celebrating the 20th anniversary of the OK Kids Corral, it was revealed that all proceeds from the Toby Keith and Friends Golf Classic would be dedicated to supporting the Foundation's mission of providing a cost-free home away from home for children with cancer and their families. The evening of the event was filled with emotional tributes to Toby Keith, whose vision and generosity had made the Foundation's mission possible. Even in his absence, Toby's warmth was felt in every corner of the event. The highlight of the night came with a monumental announcement. All proceeds from the Toby Keith and Friends Golf Classic would be dedicated to the OK Kids Corral, ensuring its continued support for families in need. On the 20th anniversary of the event, they reached a new fundraising record as they made over $3.1 million. The funds would go directly towards providing essential resources and support for these children and their families. Darcy's heartfelt performances and her personal connection to the cause resonated deeply with the audience, making the event a resounding success. Her presence brought joy and inspiration to those who needed it most, reinforcing the Foundation's mission of providing a supportive and nurturing environment for pediatric cancer patients. Darcy has remained a source of support and inspiration for young cancer patients. She visits hospitals, spends time with children undergoing treatment and sharing her story of survival. Her presence brought smiles and hope to those who needed it most, showing them that they too could overcome their challenges and pursue their dreams. She also continues to chase her dreams, some even different from her primary act of being a puppet master. One time during her interview with Vogue, Darcy spoke to her fans from the comfort of her room. In the background, a keyboard could be seen, hinting at yet another one of her artistic pursuits. Darcy's proficiency with the piano is evident, a skill she has honed since childhood. Viewers caught a rare glimpse of this side of her as she casually played a tune on her keyboard. Her fingers dancing across the keys is a testament to the countless hours she has dedicated to mastering the instrument. While the world first came to know Darcy as a gifted ventriloquist, it quickly became apparent that her talents were many. Singing has always been at the heart of her performances, her voice harmonizing seamlessly with her puppet companions. Each duet showcased not only her ability to ventriloquize, but also her impressive vocal range and control, leaving audiences spellbound. Music runs deep in Darcy's veins, and her love for it extends to songwriting. Often in the quiet moments away from the spotlight, Darcy can be found with a notebook, crafting lyrics and melodies that reflect her thoughts and emotions. The act of composing allows her to channel her experiences into music, creating songs that are both personal and relatable. It's a glimpse into the soul of an artist whose journey is just beginning. But Darcy's talents don't end with music. Her artistic pursuits also include drawing and painting, activities she turns to for relaxation and expression. Adding to her list of many talents is her flair for comedy. Her wit and comedic timing have been a staple of her ventriloquism acts, earning her not just applause but genuine laughter from her audience. Comedy for Darcy is an art form in itself, one that she skillfully blends with her performances to create a uniquely entertaining experience. Public speaking is another area where Darcy has excelled. Her confidence and eloquence in interviews and public appearances are a testament to her growth and maturity. She engages her audience with ease, whether she's sharing her journey on a talk show or speaking at a charity event. Her ability to connect with people and convey her message effectively is yet another talent that sets her apart. In essence, Darcy is a great performer whose talents extend far beyond what the world saw on America's Got Talent. Do you know any other talents she might have? 